Hello, my name's Wheelie. This all started when I found I was riding this beast for four months without an MOT. I realised I needed something on my phone, easy to do, that I could fill in while I was at the MOT station or at the garage. That's how this phone app started. Choose the Zebra app and first of all enter your bike details. Put all your details in and make sure you choose your make and model from the drop down list so you can compare your bike with the same bike ridden by other people. You stick your insurance details in uh, and put a reminder in so that you can shop around next year so you don't get ripped off by auto renewal. There's uh, put your annual premium in and your policy number in case you need to exchange details. You can also dial straight out providing you put the claims number in. There's a data tag entry there if you've got data tag. Do the same for your breakdown and recovery. Again, stick a reminder and the call number in so you can call straight out. You can put your loan details in if you've got them so you can remind yourself of that. For an MOT, you might want to put a reminder in by date. But for something like an oil change, you might want to put a reminder in by miles. All the reminders work in the same way. You get a choice between date and mileage. And there's loads. When you get to the petrol station, it literally takes 10 seconds once you've filled up with fuel to enter the details. Let me show you. This is live. There you go to motorcycle logs and you enter. Uh, all the, the date's already correct, so you just enter how much you spent. That's on the pump. Just look up and put the, put the entrance in. Then you put in how many litres. Again, that's on the pump. You just got to look up and, and put that in. You can always do this in the queue once you've got your receipt as well. Um, but I do it right at the pump. Put your mileometer reading in which is obviously off your bike. There you go, that's literally 10 seconds and it's done. And that shows you your average miles per gallon. You can then see how many miles per gallon you got for each individual tank. So if it drops suddenly and you can't explain why, you weren't too up or doing something uh, crazy, you know something's gone wrong with your bike. In my case it was a broken fuel pipe dripping fuel. Once I'd fixed it, the fuel consumption went back up again. You can add a new bike by swiping to the left, you can add as many as you like and you can also change them to cars. When you're putting your bike in, try and find a word that re that's unique to your bike. So if you type in Fireblade, you'll get a short list of only bikes that, of all the different types of Fireblade. If, on the other hand, you type in uh, CBR, you'll get all the CBRs, which is a lot, a lot more bikes. So be careful about that and choose the word that's easiest for you. So type in Tenere for a Super Tenere or Africa for an Africa Twin, whatever. You can see loads more CBRs than there are Fireblades. You can also uh, change motorcycle to car and when you choose your model then if you choose something like a Mondeo you'll see you get all the different types of Mondeo. Uh, who would have known there were quite that many different Mondeos ever built? If you want to uh, get in touch, if you go to your motorcycle details and then ch click on your change my profile, you can uh, email me, you can also uh, feedback to your friends using Facebook and Twitter. And that's the app, your motorcycle costs in black and white.